After helping the men's basketball team pick up two road wins, sophomore guard Matt Harris was dubbed as this week's Sage Bank Riverhawk of the Week. He started off by pouring in a career-high 32 points as the Riverhawks edged UMBC in an overtime thriller, and then chipped in with 14 points in the win over Vermont and Burlington. Harris credited his teammates and coaches for his career night in Baltimore. You know, overall, it was a great team win, a uh, good road win against a very good team. And, um, you know, just uh, collectively as a group, we played well defensively from start to finish. My teammates, you know, got me involved. Uh, coaches set me up where I could succeed in the offense, and um, we all did a pretty good job. The Riverhawks had a challenging non-conference schedule, which may have paid dividends last week when the Riverhawks pulled out a 93-82 victory in front of nearly 2,000 fans at Patrick Gymnasium in Burlington. Our non-conference schedule was very, uh, I think, very tough this year, and um, that definitely prepares us for environments like we faced at, uh, at Vermont. You know, it was a tough crowd. Um, we were up early, and then um, obviously it's a basketball game, a game of runs, and they made the run late. And uh, we were able to just dig down deep enough and, and uh, secure the win. Harris says the team's balance and offensive firepower has made the growing pains of a young team fun and is looking forward to the squad's development in years to come. It's very fun, you know, when, you know, not just one guy has to do everything. Uh, it's very fun that each and every night any one of us could step up. Like the one, uh, UMBC was, it was myself. And then Vermont, you know, Logan came off the bench and uh, gave us great minutes and great production. And yeah, especially because one thing special about this team is just how young we are and how you know gifted and talented and just there's so much to you know to, to come in the future is just uh, it's, it's pretty special.